Hello everyone, what is up? Hopefully you guys are having an amazing day. Today we're going to be talking about what is happening with XRP in the XRP community. Now in CoinMarketCap, XRP is at $0.25. Cents. It looks like a lot of coins are in the green today as well. But now guys, before we jump into news, I like to say I'm not a financial advisor, nor is financial advice, just just certain statement value only. XRP Crow, so you know. You have one of the most bullish calls out there uh, for Bitcoin, not just the a million dollar mark, but a million dollars within five years. Yeah, I think that's about right. Um, and that, whether it's five years, six years, we're going to go through two of these halving cycles. Um, and just from what I know from all of the institutions, all of the people I speak to, there is an enormous wall of money coming into this. It's an enormous wall of money. Just the pipes aren't there to allow people to do it yet. And that's coming, but it's on everybody's radar screen and there's a lot of smart people working on it. So I think it's gonna be not because the world's collapsing, it's because there's gonna be adoption by the real large pools of capital. A lot of money is coming. There's an, there is an enormous wall of money coming into Bitcoin and crypto in general. Next week comes from Ripple. Today we launched Line of Credit, a new beta service that allows RippleNet customers using on-demand liquidity to instantly source the capital and initiate payments using XRP. Look at this guys, huge news. But if you go down here, surprised they didn't save this announcement for Swell. Must mean they have bigger ones lined up. Look at this guys, a lot of news are incoming. Like I said, it's going to be happening quick, quick, and quicker. Squawk box a sweet out. Um, it's a fascinating effort to try to get, get Congress to understand what's really happening here uh, behind crypto. There are questions, by the way, about whether these donations, if this, if this $50, $50 of Bitcoin turns into I don't know what, uh, does, 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 it, does it create any, uh, any, any legal ethic, ethical issues? No, absolutely not. Look, the best way to learn something new is to experience experience it for yourself. And we want our elected officials to experience the power of blockchain technology in their own hands. And our hope is that members will start to understand the critical importance blockchain technology is going to play in the global economy for many generations to come. That's the point of us. How much of though is this an effort at, at pushing Congress to, I imagine, create laws or, or open up some laws around cryptocurrencies and blockchain and the like? And how much of it is about dealing with the regula regulatory uh, complex? Because to some degree, ultimately, it's going to be the Treasury Department and it's going to be the SEC, which is going to decide the fate and future of all of this, no? It's bigger than that. Blockchain technology is the most important technological innovation we will see in our lifetimes. Blockchain is the financial infrastructure of the new digital economy. Look, there's many other nations like China, Singapore, Japan, Switzerland, the European Union. They understand this and they are all racing to have dominance in this space. And the U.S. isn't even on the playing field. This would be a significant challenge to both our national security and our economic security to have foreign actors controlling the systems and the governance that will power the digital economy. This is our message. Blockchain is the financial infrastructure of the new digital economy. Biggest wealth opportunity in our lifetimes, guys. Kaboom, Asuira. Well, this has put doubt in my mind about XLM. Ripple does everything possible to support XRP and the XRP ecosystem. And I only see a push from Stellar to push the rails. And so you can, again, disagree with me and point me to a direction where it shows me that they are uh, in some way supporting lumens like XRPs supported by Ripple. But I don't see it. I haven't found it and I don't see it. And you just heard from the senior strategist from the Stellar Foundation. And it's very clear that lumens is not a part of their focus at all and Ripple does so what do you guys think about this even the ibm guy said that they could potentially use xrp with ibm world wire and a breeze to see it out what is the great reset hi everyone i'm on port road in barry and i just drove past um this bus shelter and i saw this sign and uh, i recognized it straight away the colors and the 
uh, the branding the great reset um, I had been sent something similar and it seems to be a campaign that uh, a lot of people are witnessing at the moment in places like bus shelters and town centres um, so please do continue to share uh, images of that I don't really know what it's all about it seems to be linked to the World Economic Forum but but uh, certainly I am as a journalist interested to see and find out a little bit more about the Great Reset and obviously quite a lot of money is being spent on this campaign at the moment and if you look at the World Economic Forum YouTube channel as well there are a lot of videos and promotional material around it uh, so what is the Great Reset I think that's what we need to start asking ourselves next there we go guys it is happening again we've seen a lot of 11s in that video now guys there's a fun part of xrp in the xrp community now this is quite interesting kaboom as we know mayflower from the uk to america in reverse america to uk maybe bearable guy was hinting of moving overseas If we go down here well look what we have here perfect timing it's possible guys well just your sweet out the death of bitcoin means the rise of xrp i wasn't lying the end of privacy coins is drawing ever closer while the push for transparency remains a hot top due to crime the sacrifice for example let me list a sweet out this picture right here we can see the reset the reset is coming again a lot of things should be happening guys next it comes from full jack the saga continues pull the plan is fully in motion and its initial phases are nearly all complete event nine to fall according to prior correspondence prepare xrp brainstorm as sweet so it begins 14th october apple announcement heart connection we can see is Apple coming into the play? Luminous Design is sweet out. They are currently creating a network in the Earth orbit. Digital money can't be shut down by any entity. SpaceX is helping with that. A payment system doesn't require ground internet, but space internet. Cash will start burning by 2021. 2025 should fade away totally. You can see the whole world in connectivity. Mac attack is sweet out. XRP will be the bridge for everything. USD, we can see all of that right there. CBDCs, QFS, derivatives. In a matter of seconds, quadrillion dollars, all the money. XRP will be the standard. The bridge is already here. Ripple, now the highway that crosses it. XRP. Everything, guys. Every single thing. All the money. Procrippler sweet out one more thing to ponder as I walk away the line of credit to boost ODL payment funding was announced today was pretty large they could have held on to this they could have held on to this until swell they didn't why didn't they because they have one huge announcement coming that makes this look like nothing here we go guys swell 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 it's going to be huge when it does happen it looks like there's going to be a huge announcement incoming as well that's bigger than the line of credit. Obvious rise of sweet out. Alts are suffering and Bitcoin is still at 10k. When Bitcoin goes down, there will be a purge and a lot of alts will die. And it's coming soon. As it comes from the one, while we sleep. Then central banks shuts down SWIFT network. May have to adopt cash alternatives until the elections are settled and the citizens along with the state have reached a decision. Crypto will as sweet out interest rate volatility just hit an all time low. Historically, historical data shows that when the index is this low, it's followed by a volatility spike and a stock market crash. With how bad the economy is looking, we are likely going to see something much worse than 2008. Look at the correlation, guys. Will there be a worse crash than 2008? Gecko Suida, October surprise, 10-15. A ripple swell big announcement, possibly the Amazon and or Apple partnership. Possible guys, everything's possible. Again, huge announcement. The Burble Bull, Suida, Kraken became a bank. Let me tell you where this goes. Coinbase will become a bank. Ripple will become a bank. Question is when IPO. What do we hear today? Line of credit for Ripple. 
the breath in as we know who's got the Mr. Pool drop. We can see the connections being made right here. No signal, please stand by. Here's the drop from Mr. Pool. It looks awfully the same. Same colors. The final two for today's video comes from Baba Cucks. XRP's ready. UK's new start. Let's get going. What do you guys think, guys? It might be happening, UK maybe, who knows, but who knows what will happen at the end of the day. But anyways guys, hopefully you guys did enjoy today's video, if you guys did please leave a like, subscribe if you guys are ready, feel free to be a member of the channel. I'll see you guys in the next video, hopefully you guys are having an amazing day, and then guys, see ya. This is the beginning of the greatest economic cycle this country has had since World War II. And I knew the things that Donald would do, and he hasn't even got started. But this is the eye of the mother from storm, the perfect storm. It ain't never going to get any better. Never. This is perfect for the QLA model. If I could have written the mother a prescription or a formula, I couldn't have written it any better. Low interest rates, money's free, you stupid f Massive chaos. And Donald's going to rip the mother economy apart. And he's going to f for practice in a good way. This is it. It ain't never going to get any better. This is like a multiple orgasm in the rest of your life, you fucking slags that are in the audience. This is it. Sometimes I don't want to hear what Dan has to tell me. But as I wrote in one of my blogs, the old man, he's always right. Because he's telling you what you don't want to hear about yourself, but what you know is true. And that is, you're not stepping yourself up. You're not stepping your game up. And you get caught up in fear. As Dan says, false expectations appear in you.